What's going on everybody? Welcome to another video. Welcome to Double Upload December Day 4. Today we're going to be taking a look at and reviewing and going over and admiring the New Zealand Silver Fern. That's right, that's right. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe to this one and my second channel. If you want to join the Precious Metals VIP Club, that's linked in the description. And if you want to get a DYDSS t-shirt, hoodie, sticker, or coffee mug, also linked in the description, as well as everything else. So today is December 4th, but believe it or not, I'm actually filming it on August 3rd. That's right, filming some of these videos very far in advance. And we're going to be taking a look at the Silver Fern today, the beautiful New Zealand Silver Fern. I know I have a lot of stuff on screen. Let's cover all that up so we can laser in on this right here. Believe it or not, this was actually given to me as a gift. This was sent in from someone who goes by EPK all the way in New Zealand. That's right. This isn't just a piece of silver from New Zealand. It was sent to me by someone who lives in New Zealand. So shout out and thank you to EPK. Grateful, thankful, and appreciative. Sent me this back in 2018, maybe 2019, but I want to say 18. So for those of you who do not know, the silver fern has become somewhat of a symbol of New Zealand in a lot of ways. And by the way, this is not a coin. At first, I thought it was. This is actually a round no face value this is a silver round but the silver fern has become somewhat of a symbol of new zealand and according to what the legend says the silver fern once lived in the sea and it was asked to come and live in the forest to play a significant role in guiding people so for those of you who didn't know a little bit of the backstory behind the round right there, now you know. And I'm also pulling up JM Bullion's website, and I'm going to read you something that it says. A little bit of a description before we go further into this round right here. And I'm also going to zoom out and hold it up closer, because I think this would probably give you a better look than the way it was just sitting. So according to JM Bullion's website, this one ounce silver fern round is among the rarer bullion pieces produced by the prestigious New Zealand Mint based in Auckland. It was released prior to the mint's acclaimed silver Taku Hawksbill Turtle series and has since become one of the precious metal industry's more sought after collectibles. Beautiful round right here. As you can see on the bottom, the silver fern. New Zealand on top, the image right there. I'll say this right off the bat, just the design alone, absolutely beautiful. I'm a sucker for really any type of nature design, whether it be a fern like this or even the Canadian maple leaf or really any animal at all. I don't even care what it is. An eagle, a panda, a kangaroo. I've always been a big fan of coins, rounds, and bars that have animals or trees or leaves, or in this case, a fern. So, big fan. The background is very, very simple. Plain, simple, sleek. It makes the silver fern pop quite a bit. And now let's flip it over. Over here, we can see New Zealand. And then, obviously, at the bottom, one ounce fine silver. Three nines fine. Now, believe it or not, EPK, out in New Zealand, sent me two pieces of silver from New Zealand. I'm going to save the other one for another video. I wanted to do them side by side, but I figured it's probably better to give them each their own individual video. If you've been watching my videos or tuning into this channel for a while, you'll probably know which round I'm talking about, but I wanted to dedicate this video to talking about the Silver Fern, an absolute beauty. I do say so myself. I mean, just look at that right there. Absolutely stunning. 
it's always interesting to see coins, rounds, and bars that you're unfamiliar with that come from other countries who have bullion that you're, once again, unfamiliar with. It's always fun to discover new pieces of silver. It's what I do from time to time. I mean, I'm, I'm an American. I was born in America. Been living in America my entire life. But my family's Italian. So what I've done in the past is just simply go on Google and just type in random Italian coins. I never would have thought to Google New Zealand coins, rounds, or bars. But after receiving this from EPK, I went and did so. And I was pleasantly surprised. They have some pretty cool coins out there as well. They have the kiwi, not the fruit, the bird, little kiwi bird on a coin. Pretty high premium. Last time I checked, I was trying to get myself a little gold kiwi bird coin. Could not do it. I could not pull the trigger on the premium, but it's an absolute incredible, gorgeous coin. So New Zealand, or as JM Bullion says, the prestigious New Zealand mint. I'm incredibly impressed. I want everybody watching this video right now to head on down to the comments and let me know. Do you have any New Zealand silver ferns? Do you have any New Zealand silver or gold in general? Do you have any other coins, rounds, or bars from New Zealand? The New Zealand mint. Head on down to the comments and let me know anything and everything related to the New Zealand silver fern round and what you think once again shout out and thank you to epk for sending this my way i'm grateful thankful and appreciative thank you very much for sending this to my p.o box two two and a half maybe even close to three years ago at this point much respect i greatly appreciate it thank you everybody for tuning into this video make sure to give it a thumbs up if you haven't already subscribe to the channel if you're new subscribe to my second channel if you haven't already done so if you want to join the precious metals vip club i'd really appreciate that the link will be in the description as well and of course if you want to get yourself a dydss t-shirt sticker hoodie or coffee mug that will obviously also be linked in the description as well as a bunch of other silver and gold supplies airtight capsules airtight tubes mint tubes generic tubes anti-tarnish paper mini lock boxes anything you need for the precious metals it's right there in the description thank you everybody for tuning in to double upload december day four don't you dare stop smiling peace